It's important to know that any computer that's connected or online could potentially be hacked. Now you have choices and places where you may want to keep your cryptocurrency wallet. Now, if you keep them on your mobile phone, if you keep them on your desktop computer, those could potentially be hacked and those wallets can be stolen and the keys can be stolen. The evolution of security around cryptocurrency resulted in the development of something called a hardware wallet. You can disconnect it, put it offline, keep it in a safe, keep it in a bank vault someplace, you can bury it in the ground. It is 100% offline. And so that if your systems, your mobile phone or your computer or something was to get hacked into, there would be no way for a criminal to jump from that piece of technology into a hardware wallet that's kept offline. And typically, those hardware wallets also have screens on them and the ability for you to enter in a physical passcode to unlock them before they can even be utilized in a piece of technology, like your mobile phone or a desktop computer or a laptop. Many of the hardware wallet manufacturers have a list of key phrases that can be utilized to restore another hardware wallet. The typical use of a hardware wallet is that when you first initialize it, the manufacturers will have you create a list of say 25 words. You take that list of words, you keep it in a very safe place. Again, you store it separate from that hardware wallet. In the event that something was to physically happen to that hardware wallet, you can drop it, you can lose it, you can get run over by a car. You wanna be able to have a way to restore that wallet to a brand new piece of hardware. If you have a hardware wallet and you have no backup and you have no way to restore that and you physically lose it, your cryptocurrency is gone forever. So just like any other piece of technology, hardware wallets are only going to be as secure as the design that went into them from a hardware and physical standpoint and also from the software that's running on them. There are lots of manufacturers of hardware wallets out there. Many of them have put out firmware updates in the past to close security vulnerabilities. And there have even been a few that have been susceptible to physical attacks to extract the private keys. Now, just like any other piece of technology that you own or anything that you wanna keep safe, it's important that you maintain a knowledge of the physical possession of that hardware wallet. Keep in mind that anybody who has physical access to that hardware wallet could potentially extract the contents of that wallet and your private keys.